it's your girl Ty. Welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, sit back, relax, and enjoy, and hit the subscribe button. <laughs> Today, I wanted to do something really soft and girly, and something good for summertime as well. So I came up with this pink halo look. Also, as you know, I'm pairing these makeup looks with outfits, so this also goes really good with the outfit that I'm going to be showing you guys a week or two from now. So before I jump into this video, I want to talk about two things. First, if you are subscribed or you're going to subscribe, please hit the little bell below so you can get the notifications every time I upload. Because without you hitting that little bell, you won't get notified and you won't be able to, well, you'll be able to see my videos, but you won't get the notification. And you want to get the notification when I do these videos because you want to be all caught up, especially when I do that outfit video. So hit the button. <laughs> and also, I want to talk about my headband just a little bit. It's something I really like. I got it at the Dance Africa Festival this year. And I believe that this headband either, I can't believe it was for freedom or strength. I believe it was for strength. I believe that's why I got this headband. But I'm going to try to find the lady on Instagram and her website so I can put it down below in case this is something you might want to get to. So without further ado, let's get into this video. So I'm starting with face today. I'm going in with my MAC Studio Fluid NW43. And I'm just going to put this on my face. I am going to go through this part kind of fast because you guys have seen my foundation routine already. If not, I will link it below so you can see how I do my full face foundation routine. For concealer, I'm going in with my LA Girl Pro Concealer in the shade Warm Honey. I apply that under my eyes, down my nose, my forehead, and under my cheekbone, under right where I'm going to put my contour. For contour, I'm using my Black Opal Foundation Stick in the shade Hazelnut. Now I'm just taking my blender and I'm blending everything out. I'm setting my concealer with my Ben Na Banana Powder. I am going to set my whole face with my Mineralized Skin Finish in the shade Medium Deep. And this is from MAC. I like to contour my face with my Black Radiance Press Powder in the shade Rich Mahogany. And you guys know I love my Lemonade palette from Lena Lashes, so I am using that to highlight my face. And for blush, I am using my favorite blush, which is Max Peach Twist. Let's get into eyes. So today I'm gonna to be using my Jacqueline Hill palette. I'm starting off with this soft brown color just because I wanted something 
that was close to my skin complexion. I wanted this look to be really soft and pretty, so I'm gonna be using light colors today. Now I'm dipping into the color that's right next to it, and that's a soft brown as well. I'm gonna put that in my crease too. So now I'm using my Anastasia Beverly Hills Soft Glam Palette. I am dipping into this pretty color which is rose pink and I'm going to put that all over my lid. This color is so pretty, one of my favorite colors in this palette. So now I'm dipping into Mulberry, so I just want to add a little definition to this look, smoke it out just a little bit, but not too much. Now to create a halo look, what you want to do is take a little bit of concealer, so I'm using a concealer that I used earlier, which is my LA Pro Girl Concealer. I took a little bit of that, put it on a brush, and then you want to tap that right in the center of your eye. Not on your whole lid, but just the center of your lid. And then we're going to put another shade that's a little lighter than that pink on top of that. But that's what gives that halo effect. And I'm sorry if this isn't close enough. It wasn't until now when I'm watching the video that I realized that I should have zoomed in a little more. So I'm going to try to make sure I do that better next time so you guys can see a little better. Now I'm going to dip into glistening and I'm going to put that right over that concealer. This is going to give that look a nice little pop. Now I'm just going back into rose pink and I'm just tapping that around where I put glistening so I won't have any harsh lines. So I applied my lashes and my liner off camera. Now I'm back and I'm putting that rose pink on my waterline. Then I'm going to go ahead and go over that with a black eyeliner and I'm going to apply that on my waterline as well. Now I am putting on lipstick. You really can use any lipstick that you have. If you want to do something like a soft pink, a bright pink, it's up to you. Any pink lips that you have, you can pair with this eye. And this is the finished look, guys. I really hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you next time. Bye!